Hello everyone, Jerstagram10 here. Welcome to my channel. This is my first ever video that I'm going to be putting online with my face in it. Yeah, kind of scary but kind of exciting at the same time. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm really looking forward to bringing you some content to this channel. So what to expect from this channel would basically be photography stuff, anything photography. Right now I'm fairly limited in terms of stuff that I can do Gear review wise, I do have some lenses. I'm shooting on Canon at the moment, so I will do some lens reviews. Some videos about how I feel about all the lenses that I have at the moment. Other gear as well, like tripods, microphones, things of that nature, I'll definitely be doing some reviews on as well. In terms of tutorials, I will be doing some tutorials as well. Stuff like Lightroom, probably not too much of Photoshop because I don't really use Photoshop that much, but definitely Lightroom, Adobe Premiere, and also Final Cut Pro 10, which I have a copy of as well. So I have the best of both worlds in terms of video editing, which is something new that I'm getting into as well. I haven't really done much video editing in terms of videography. I have edited videos before in terms of gameplay capture, stuff like that, but that's that's a story for another time. This channel it will be solely dedicated to cinematography, videography, and things of that nature. So I'm just putting this up as a test. I do want to move forward with the channel. Mainly this is more so for myself, to be honest, just to get used to the whole vlogging format. A vlog is something that I've never done before at all. I do have all the gear, well, basically all the gear. I have some basic vlogging gear that I have that I can use to create vlogs. It's not gonna be a thing where I'm doing like daily vlogs or things of that nature. I will be doing like a, a vlog format, I guess, in terms of some of the stuff that I put up. I'm looking forward to putting my creativity to the test in terms of moving over to a completely different format, which is videography. I am, I guess you could say, well enough versed in the world of photography. I mean, I don't know everything, and I don't think I ever will know everything about photography, but I have been taking photos for quite some time now. But videography and creating videos and vlogs is certainly something that's, that's new to me. I'm really, really excited to be able to create this content and put my own little, sprinkle my own creativity into the, the traditional vlog format and how that goes on YouTube. So in saying that, uh, in terms of YouTube, I would like to get some feedback on this video. If anyone is actually watching it, please tell me what your thoughts are, any ideas that you would have, anything you'd like to see in terms of gear review or in terms of tutorials. I do have a small series in mind, more so focused on photography, but it will incorporate video into that as well. I won't get too much into it right now because that is something that I do want to keep kind of under wraps until I do get the series underway, some footage shot for that, etc. I'm really looking forward to getting out and shooting some B-roll as well. B-roll is something that has really attracted me, having watched other YouTubers as well and put up their B-roll. It is something that's that really, really appeals to me. So I'm really excited about being able to do this on YouTube. I feel like YouTube is a really good place, a really good format to be able to do these kind of things. I'm hoping that I can garner some interest in my videos and in my channel and be able to bring my own unique perspective to YouTube and to my audience and, and help them along the way and, and also have my audience help me as well in, in terms of growing and in terms of learning. It's I mean, I'm learning every day when it comes to photography and videography. That's something that I really want to continue to do. But if I can make some videos that you know help people and impact people, that's something that I would take pride in for sure and I'm sure everybody would take pride in that. I'm thinking in terms of actual content and structure-wise, how that's gonna work out with YouTube and uploads, I'm probably gonna try and do Monday and Friday. I think Monday and Friday are probably the best days to be able to put stuff up. So with today being Monday as I'm shooting this, I will put this up, video up today and then we'll see about maybe getting a video for Friday. Consistency is something that I struggle with in terms of making videos. So I definitely want to push myself with this. I am extremely excited for this channel. I'm extremely passionate about the stuff that I want to do with this channel and the stuff that goes on behind the scenes in the channel as well, such as taking the photos, taking the videos, editing, all that stuff. I'm very, very passionate 
about that. So I want to be able to translate that passion into consistency, hopefully, but we'll see how that goes. But definitely for the time being, Monday and Friday, I think is a good schedule. It's not too much, but it's also, it's not too little. I mean, you do have a Monday and a Friday. It's a nice kind of way to start the week and a nice way to end the week. So that's a, a good format, I think. Let me know in the comments below if you have any other suggestions, by the way. So yeah, consider this video Monday's video, my official first vlog on YouTube. I only have one other video on this channel. It's a short film that I shot, just again, trying to kind of get to, to grips with taking shots while I'm out and about and then putting those shots together in a sequence to make a short film. It's quite rough. I mean, I don't have a lot of experience in terms of building a story in terms of video. So it's something that I'm gonna get better and better at the more that I do this stuff. So I'd imagine that my first few videos, they're gonna be, I wouldn't say rough, but they're probably not gonna be up to that standard like the Peter McKinnon standard and all those other YouTubers of that level. I'm nowhere near that at the moment, but eventually, hopefully I'll get there. And that's what I'm looking forward to in, in this journey. Shout out to Peter McKinnon, by the way, Huge fan of his, his stuff is amazing. If you haven't checked him out, do make sure you go check him out as well. Pretty sure most of YouTube has probably heard of Peter McKinnon by now. His channel has absolutely blown up and he's very popular for a very good reason. So yeah, make sure you go check out Peter McKinnon. So that's it from me. Thank you very much for watching. This is, again, I know I've said it probably about four or five times now, this is my first official vlog on YouTube. I'm really happy, I'm really excited, but I'm also a little bit kind of tentative as well to see how this goes. It's uh, it's quite daunting putting your face on the internet, let alone your voice, but when you put your face on the internet as well for everybody to see, there's a different level there. So quietly excited with a little bit reserved as well about this, but I'm, I, I'm hoping that I can grow this channel, grow this video series, and at the end of the day, just improve my own skills as well. So with that said, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.